Uraka, the name Uraka stems as a translation from the word magpie. Magpie is the, uh, John Langley's uh, loving way to call his wife because her name is Margaret. So that's where it stems from. Very simple. So from Maggie or Margaret, he calls her Mags, Magpie, and then uh, started out with a vineyard in California in Ojai called Magpie. So this was the basis of the foundation. From then on, uh, as I described earlier, we, we traveled the, the right side of the Andes and also the left side of the Andes and discovered Argentinian wines. Myself, I had known about Argentinian wines since I had lived here for 18 years. And uh, we said, let, let us find a name when we start our wine business. And we said, well, what's Magpie in Spanish? And so we translated it, and it turns out to be Urax. So we came with a very strong French influence from drinking uh, interesting uh, French wines, but we quickly learned that there are certain elements that you have to respect, which is the terroir and the local traditions. And then particularly when you go into a Malbec, I mean, you're, you're not going to modify a Malbec because uh, this is, this is what, what is um, the very important uh, variety. Uh, well, Walter Bresson loves plants. He's a wonderful Yes, yes. He's a, he, exactly. And so actually when we look for winemakers, uh, we interpreted, we tasted many wines and found his style to be very similar or exactly what we wanted. So that's why we approached Walter. So that was the initial identity. And today we, we have lengthy conversations and we do samplings and barrel tastings here in Argentina and we got wines shipped back and forth continuously where we do tastings in Argentina and California and then we s exchange you know. Okay, thank you very much and I hope you enjoy Winemakers Night here at Absolutely. the Wines of Berlosa. It is my pleasure to be here. <laughs> Cheers. Thank you.